Don't hurt yourself, big boy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Whoa, whoa, hey. Drinking age still 21. Thank you very much. Unless your spirit guide gave you a fake ID, this is mine. Mm. What are you eating? I don't even know. I just know I'm hungry. All the time. Okay, that's not safe or sanitary. That's your can now. We'll label it like that. <sighs> so, what did you learn at school today? That I'm a bad dad. What are you talking about? I thought it was going great. It was going fantastic for me. And then, and, and then what? And then I found out my son spent the last year being the school punching bag and watched my daughter get a tongue bath from a psychopathic jackass. Oh, high school is delightful, isn't it? Yeah, but I think I was wrong about my spirit path. Aha, uh -huh. and who was right? See, I told you. I told you that high school was the wrong no, thing. No, no, no. High school was right, but it's not about basketball. It's about helping Alex and Maggie. Mm. Bro. I'm getting out of here. You do. Hmm. Disgusting. My kids need their father. What's going on? Oh, hey, Mark. What was that? Three pointer. You need that twice in a row? Okay. What's he do with a little pressure? Wow, you're great. You should be on the team. You should be on the team. I'm gonna get you on the team. That's it. That'll that'll solve everything. Dude, what are you talking about? Nothing. Nothing. Well, that was fun. I haven't been to happy hour in, like, a week and a half. Naomi, thank you so much. That is exactly what I needed. Oh, great. Right. Mm hmm Mike who? Yeah, exactly. Mike, I've never heard of the guy. Ow. Hey, Mom, this is Mark, Uncle Ned's bastard. Wow. I know. Someone had a kid with Uncle Ned. Ugh. You okay, Mrs. O'Donnell? Yeah, I'm fine. It's Ms. Kid, it's Ms. Scarlett. Don't forget that. All right. Wow. Wow. You look just like my husband, doesn't he? My ex-husband? <laughs> that is so weird. He's weird. What is that? Oh, oh. Scarlett? Scarlett, I need you to come Weird. Did you see that? I did. I did see him. Did you see him? I did. Nice. I did look at him. I know, honey. You've got to let that guy go just out of your brain and just move on. I mean, I know that you need to grieve a relationship. It's only natural. Okay. You wait here. I'm going to go smell him. No, 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 no. Sweetie, sweetie, sweetie. You're not allowed to smell teenagers. Sweetie, you need to hear me on this, okay? But here's the thing. Here's the other thing. Is you need to acknowledge the fact that he looks exactly like my kids. I, we discussed that, that I have looked at him, but honey, this is, this is the thing. You need to hook up with someone new. Yeah, I deserve to have somebody smile at me. Yes. And tell me I'm pretty. You do. Yeah. Even if it is to just get me to go home with him. Or lunch, but yes, we're gonna, we're gonna find you a new playmate. Ow, you little turd, you little snot. My bad, I'm so sorry. I guess it was, uh, I guess it was kind of distracted as I imagine Alex was, at hearing about how his mother, who is still married, by the way, is planning on running around with every guy she can get her hands on. If this were Afghanistan, she'd be dragged through the streets by goats with her hands cut off, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Naomi. Naomi. I don't care. Hey, guys. Oh. Okay, settle down, everybody. Take your seats. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Stand. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, today, we will be continuing our discussion on human sexuality. And as we discussed, 
The official school policy is abstinence. Now that is very sensible. I'm glad that someone here has their head screwed on straight. I think all of us should make a pact to abstain from sex. Now who's with me, you guys? Come on. <laughs> Maggie? Hmm? However, let's get real. I know asking high school seniors to be abstinent is like asking a porcupine to poop goat cheese. Yuck. So, since the majority of you are or will become sexually active at some point... Uh, but that point should be way, way in the future, right? Well, the official school position is that we prepare you for safe sex now. So please take one and pass it down. I have needs. <laughs> you don't need these. Stan, give one to Mark. No. No, you know what? He's right. He's right. I don't need one. You know why? You know why I don't need one? Because there's no one that I'm in love with. It's called making love, isn't it? I, I, maybe I'm old-fashioned, but I, I think that means that you do it with someone you love. <clears throat> and preferably when you're married. You know, when you're ready to take that love and turn it into a baby. Because that's what love is. It's, it's that first moment when you hold your baby girl and you didn't know that anything could be so small or so delicate and and you feel that tiny heartbeat, and you know that you couldn't love anything more in the whole world. And you hope that you can do right by that little girl, and always be there to catch her when she falls, and that nothing ever hurts her, not a broken arm, or a bad dream, or a broken heart. I don't even want these. Just take them. Take them. Oh, great. Fine. Wonderful. More for me. Now I got enough for the whole weekend. <laughs> Check this out. My cousin in New York sent it to me. <laughs> I hope I'm not late for our meeting. Busted for fighting. Nice. Who won? No, it was actually pretty even. Really? On YouTube, it kind of looked like you got your ass kicked. I saw it a couple times. What are you wearing? Hmm? That come. No, what? Oh, the clothes. Oh, wait. To the untrained eye, I look like a total idiot. You do, in fact. Ah, but it's actually a seduction technique known as peacocking. My outfit serves the dual function of icebreaker and attention getter. You can go in now. Watch. Mm. Are you peacocking? Really? You think that's gonna work? I think it's just mine. Is that Mrs. O'Donnell? Oh. How you doing? Hello, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. Wow, it's gonna take some getting used to. You're Ned's son? Yeah, yeah. Ned gave birth to me. Ned. Well, he didn't. He didn't give birth. You know what I meant. You, uh, you're doing some gardening. I'm redoing the backyard. Oh. You want to see? Yeah, sure. I got. Some